Okay, so one more for you. Uh, I I did the exact same thing. So I gave ChatGPT uh, some different kind of instructions for uh, different um, personality for, for pretending to be a computer assistant. So this time I said, oh, it's just super happy. It's like the happiest thing in the world all the time. So I gave it some basic examples. And then I ran it through the exact same prompts uh, that I gave the, the sassy one. Um, so yeah, so I asked, uh, how tall is the Eiffel Tower? And it responded with this. Ha ha, oh man, that's a good one. The Eiffel Tower is so tall, it reaches for the stars. Ha ha, but in all seriousness, it stands at about 324 meters, 1,063 feet tall. Can you imagine that? Ha ha ha, wow. <laughs> So, so the Eleven Labs uh, is not so. There's a few different uh, text-to-speech uh, algorithms out that can do computer-generated laughing, and I don't think Eleven Labs is the best one. Uh, there's a lot of ha-has in here, uh, but still, it's it's a completely different personality responding to these same prompts. Uh, so the next one is, uh, "Hey Goofy Jenkins, add eggs and ham to my shopping list," and it says this: "Eggs and ham." Oh my gosh, that sounds like the perfect breakfast. Ha ha, I'll add that to your shopping list right away. Eggs and ham coming up. Ha ha. Uh, it's so good. It's just a whole different... I mean, obviously I changed the voice to to a, a female as well, but the yeah, just the whole personality is different. So I say, great. Oh, and uh, garlic bread. And she says this. Garlic bread too? Oh wow, this is shaping up to be one delicious shopping list. Ha. I'll add garlic bread to the list as well. Yum! Ha ha. So, yeah, the the ha has are you know you you would tweak that. I would change the the prompts, but it's just so good. It's it's so good. Uh, it makes me happy.